Hey, so I was tagged for um, my Five Guilty Pleasures by Miss Janie here. And um, I love tags, so this is awesome. Number one, I love the Backstreet Boys. You know, I, I'm a hard rockin' chick at heart. Love rock music. But, I mean, the Backstreet Boys, they have a special place in my heart, and I love them so much. Um, you know, they're one of the bands that I actually go out and purchase their tangible CDs instead of just MP3s. And um, I've seen them four times, and um, some of their concerts were like the best nights of my life. Um, they're coming to town on my birthday this year, um, next month, August 20th, and um, I'm looking to get tickets right now because, you know, once I've seen them and I've been, you know, just a few feet away from them, there's no way that I'm going to be sitting in the back. So I've got to get the perfect tickets right up front. Um, my second most guilty pleasure, Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I had, uh, I watched Buffy from the very first time it aired way back in like, it was 96 or 97, I was still in high school, and I started watching it from the pilot on to the end of it for seven years, and um, I didn't miss it, it came on every Tuesday night, did not miss it, um, people knew to not bother me on Tuesday nights. <laughs> And um, once it got off the air, I got um, all of their seasons on, you know, DVD. And like I said, they have seven seasons. And um, this past Christmas, I got the Chosen Collection, and it's all seven seasons in one big box. And uh, plus a few extras. So, yeah, I love Buffy. Um, my third one would have to be Starbucks. I love skinny cinnamon dolce lattes. Ooh, and caramel lattes. Oh my god. Yeah. Um, third, no fourth. Guilty pleasure. Tattoos. But I don't feel guilty about them. Um, and my fifth one. I don't know. Um, see, I've covered Backstreet Boys and Buffy and Coffee. Um, Janet Ivanovich. I love her Stephanie Plum series, and you know I'm always reading for school. And um, so when I want to read, like for fun, I read a fiction book that's just you know, hilarious and insane and it just takes my mind off the day-to-day -day crap. And uh, she does a really good job at that. I don't like her other books, but I love the Stephanie Plum series. Um, so those are my five guilty pleasures. And, uh, you know, I'm with Miss Janie. A year ago, my guilty pleasures would have been Coke and macaroni and cheese and Snickers and crap like that. But my one food item was sugar-free, fat-free latte. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I've come a long way. And I will be tagging, uh, I don't know who, I'll, I'll pick when I upload this. So, um, I will see y'all later. Bye.